What's going on guys? JB Fishing back with another video and I am super stoked for today's video because I am getting a fish tank and um, later today or in the next video I'm going to catch some fish to put in this uh, tank but today we are going to be setting up this tank and getting this tank and getting a little algae eater to go in it just to help clean up the tank so anyways let's get straight into this video There you go guys, 10 gallon tank. So we decided to go with live plants. We got Amazon Compacta, whatever that is, and a large Amazon sword. Bundling that with some leaf zone liquid fertilizer and some substrate. And we're getting Anubias. And you need, you need something for the fish to hide in to start with. set this tank up. I'm going to put us into a time lapse in three, two, one. Alright guys, I just got the substrate poured. It's right here. Um, this is so the plants can grow. So I'm going to go and do another time lapse. I'm going to sort of decorate the tank. I'm going to need to rinse this off first this is the root structure this is my main decoration it's the only decoration that's going in here gotta rinse this off and then I'm gonna sort of arrange it in here like that I think but I gotta rinse it off first so let's go straight into another time lapse This time lapse is going to be a lot longer than I anticipated, so I'm just going to go fill this tank up with the bucket here, and I will get back to you as soon as that is done. All right, so I've got the tank filled up to about half inch to an inch from the little black part. I just did that so that I can stick the plants in uh, without the water flowing over. But just in case, I don't even know if this stuff affects the plants, but it's the dechlorinator. It's the API Stress Coat Plus. It just makes the water safe and, prote and protects the fish. But uh, it's always good to just start the cycle so that I can put fish in it tomorrow, which will be next video. And I'm sorry that you guys have to wait. Just five milliliters per 10 gallons. And this is a 10 gallon tank. So let's just put that in there. And now we are good to go for that. So. Just gonna wait a minute, I'm going to put the plants in it, and then we will put in the fertilizer and the, where's the stuff? This stuff makes the water clear faster. It came in the, uh, the substrate bag, so let's keep going. Here is the uh, thermometer, all the way up to 120 degrees. I don't know why you would have a fish tank that hot. Right now it's reading right at about 72 right there. Um, here we have the filter plus filter cartridges. Suppo Supposedly this filter is very, very silent and very, very quiet. So I'm going to test that out in a bit. Then you got this thing which goes on the end of this thing that goes inside of that thing. And then you got the net, top fin net. Okay, and here, this stuff all came with the tank kit. I'll leave the link to this kit in the description. So whatever could be in here. This is the, uh, the something, probably the light switch for the LEDs. So that's what that is. And here, this is probably the heater. So it comes with suction cup, and then, let's see, let's see if I can get this out of here without breaking it. Wow, the heater. This is 
pretty pretty large. Uh, I didn't expect it to be this big. And it is the right size. I thought that they might have given me the wrong size in here, but it is the 50 watt, five to 10 gallon version. So that's everything that also came, that came with this. Oh, and it also came with this lid that has LEDs in it that goes to that switch there. But I think now is the appropriate time to put these in. All right, so here we have our Anubia. That's what it is. This is gonna be our foreground point because it's uh, pretty small. So I'm just gonna stick this in here. So we got the Anubia in there. Sorry about that. Right there. And um, it just got my arm super dirty. So I'm gonna get this filter running to clean up the water a bit. And then add, well, and once I'm done digging around in the substrate, I'm gonna put this clarifier in there. So let's just get this filter running. All right, guys, got the filter going here. Um, I have my Amazon Compacta there, my Anubias, and my Amazon Sword is right there. You, can, you guys can probably see them. And then, so now, all I'm gonna do is just pop this in here, along with this, which is, this is plant fertilizer. Ah! This is liquid plant fertilizer. And this is water clarifier. So let's just pop these in here. So, filter's running back there. I got the lid with the LEDs on. Uh, the water clarifier is trying to do its thing. I got the fertilizer in there, trying to grow the plants. And now all we do is just wait and then let it cycle. And then tomorrow we can put some fish in here, which that's gonna be next video. Sorry for all you people who wanted to see fish in here today, but it's got a cycle. And I made this video an, an okay length. Oh yeah, also gotta put the, the the heater in here today and the thermometer. All right, guys. After a while of trying to get this filter to work. We finally did it. And you my guys might run into this problem, so I'm gonna tell you how to do it. So, take scoops of water from your tank. I did I just did it with this cup. And you got to fill this up right here, um, all the way until it starts pouring out of there. And then um you have to just uh, let it sit in the water with, with it on, and you'll see the water level start to just sort of bump up and down back there. You just wait for it. There will be an inconsistent flow. But um, just keep waiting and you will get this nice waterfall uh, with this quiet filter. This filter, it's only 10 bucks, so um, it's not that bad if you have to replace it. But here it is, it's still clearing up. But um, right now, here's the tank. We have our Amazon Compacta or something like that. We have our Anubias. And then we have our Amazon Sword way, way, way back there. Can't see it yet because it's still clearing up. But, thumbs up. So guys, that is going to end today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And subscribe if you are new. Because in the next video, I'm going to be catching and putting fish right into this bad boy right here. And I'm going to grab a fish from PetSmart that I might I might have told you. I don't even know yet. Well, I don't remember. But, um, so I'm going to be putting fish in the next video. So subscribe so you get notified. And turn on the notifications bell so that you actually do get notified. Um, so, anyways, remember to go anywhere, fish everywhere. Bye, peeves.